I'm in. Dead end, huh? Thank you, Mad Magazine. Come in, team. Come in, Chamber 2. Nova! La cueva es inestable. Ten cuidado. Are you okay? What do you need? Finn Shepard. Good morning! Yes, the Shepherds. I'm Prime Minister Ravenwood, and I must tell you how both myself and our friends at NATO are, are so pleased that the U.S. has decided to send the finest shark soldier in such an hour of need. When the President, the U.N., and your father ask you to help Europe sort out their problems, how do you say no? I'll be your escort to the emergency session of NATO being held at Parliament today, and this is your... The name's Gil. Let me know if you need anything. Ah. Yeah, our other kids are back home dealing with the aftermath of the last attack, so... Semper paratus. Right, Dad? Yes, son. A shepherd is always prepared. <laughs> yes, thank you. Mr. Shepherd, emergency call for you. Hello. Nova, where are you? We're about to start the strategy meeting with NATO. You want me to meet you where? I thought Nova retired after she rode the Eiffel Tower across the Atlantic. You know her better than that. Be careful, Mrs. Chopper. It's a long way down. I got it. You've done this before? I've done everything before. Not gonna argue with that. Mission accomplished. Eat your heart out, Cruz. More like mission demolished. Where'd you learn to climb like that? CrossFit? Hi, Finn. Miss me? Hi, Nova. After the shark natives ate my family, I busted them out of the well with my chainsaw. Sharks run for me now. He's quite the little rebel, isn't he? Yes, I treasure every moment I have with him. Hmm. Remember, this isn't about sharks. It's about family. Why'd we stop? I'll show you how we protect our family in the UK. Can you keep a secret? Boop. Please, right this way. Luella will take it from here. Ah, the shepherds. It's quite the setup you have here. You're just in time to see the latest in UK defense. In the unfortunate event of an encounter with a shark, we'll arm Londoners with a variety of effective, yet elegant, weaponry. Cool. Prepare the dummy, Miss Moore, please. Just a sec. Ready, Llewellyn? Helmets on? Ah, yes. Wait. You'll want these. you'll probably want to duck. Just two clicks of a pen and... Whoa! Not bad, eh? <laughs> oh. oh, I see you've got some wings there, little chap. But this will really make you fly. Hey, huh? Just your size, chap. Now this shark tack creates a fiber optic shell, enabling anyone inside to weather any storm. It also includes a storm tracking device. You'll always know where he is. Earth to mommy, come in, please. 
What's really going on here? The writing's on the wall. These storms have happened before. All around the planet. But get this. Humanity not only fought Sharknados in the past, they won. How? With that, it's called the Harness of Dukawaka. The what? Shark God. Of course. Shark God. The Druids use the Harness as defense against the Sharknados. And according to this map, it's saying it's hidden somewhere in this cave. So you came here to get it? Nope. We came here to get it. We've been in this together since the beginning. Couldn't leave you out now. Sounds like you miss me too. It makes you so sure this whole shark god stuff isn't just a fairy tale. It's history, Finn. The real deal. My sisterhood discovered sites like this in Bali, Jerusalem. Sisterhood? We've met some of them, actually. My Sharknado sisters. Please tell me you started a band, not a cult. Sharks. Why is it always got to be sharks? Tag, you're it. There it is. That's not my style. I'll take this, though. Hold on. This might be booby trapped, too.
hell is going on? Same shark, different day. Finn! Where are you? We're five miles out of London. A Sharknado just took out Stonehenge. Radar confirms a cyclone entering our airspace. Have the helicopter take you to the Royal Air Force pad, and we'll have your family meet you there. I'll see you guys soon. Dad, can you hear me? I can't get clean signal. This is Jeff Rawson reporting from the United Kingdom, and as you can see, here in London, it is a tsunami of shark field terror! The Prime Minister's called for a convoy to get everyone out of the city safely. You need to hurry. Hello again. Welcome back to Good Morning Britain. Uh, we have some breaking news, a breaking weather alert for all of London. The Ministry of SW has issued a red warning. A T10 level Sharknado is approaching the London area. London's under attack. It's not safe for us or for anyone else. What are we meant to do? We're stuck in traffic. Well, look, we've got word that evacuations are currently taking place in the entire London area at the moment. And citizens are advised to stay away from the storm. Please do not confront, aggravate, fight, pet or feed the sharks. A skyfall. Proceeding. Under bridge is falling down. It's not gonna hold. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Come on, come on. We need some wheels. I got it, Finn. Be right back. Go, go. Sir, you should be avoiding danger, not heading into it. I face far more greater threats. The hunter becomes the hunted! Just kill Brett Michaels! 
Safety, I'm going back. Okay, come on, Gil, come with me. I'm gonna hunt down by shark! Gil, protect Nova! Come on! Okay, Nova! Get down! I hate to say this, but it looks like the Sharknado is heading directly towards Buckingham Palace. The authorities there confirm the Queen is trapped inside as all entrances are blocked by sharks. Now, if the Sharknado hits the palace, it will be a devastating loss, not just to the British Empire, but to the entire civilized world.
God save the queen. Wrong. It's Gil. What about him? Where is he? I tried to hold on to him, but the storm was too strong. It, just, it, it, it all happened so quickly. I don't know. I was holding on to him as tight as I could, Fanny, but the storm, it was so strong. It was stronger than anything we've ever seen. It, it ripped him right out of my arms. You let him go? Sorry, I, I tried my best. You should have never let him go. April, don't. Why are you always protecting her? I'm sorry. I'm only human, April. Finn, he's gone. We'll get him back. I don't care what it takes. I don't care what I have to do. I'm gonna get him back. These are tough times and tough circumstances. We just have to deal, right? Oh my, oh my god, you guys! It's Gil. He's alive? Look, the radar locked onto his suit's tracking device. Right now he's in a wind system at 500 miles per hour towards Holland. He's alive? Yes, yes, look at his vitals. It's Holland? Yes, it's his helmet. Llewellyn said that it would protect him in the strongest of storms, including a shark NATO. We're gonna get him back. How? NATO. If you think I'm going to some conference with my kids swirling around no, in some no, storm. Finn. The leading scientists and physicists in the whole world are all at an emergency session in London right now. If there's any hope in getting your son back, it's them. We should have never gone into that cave. That's when all this started. I'm gonna get him back. I promise. I won't let you down. Hello again. Welcome back to what's been a devastating morning here in England. Thankfully, though, the storm is over. We also have reports that revolutionary and controversial billionaire scientist Dr. Gerald Michael Angel will showcase his new aerial defence against future Sharknado attacks. He's calling it the Hindenburg XP-3000. A blimp. Yeah, good luck with that one. These guys are top of the line. We're in good hands. Let's make this quick. Do we even know what the Chinese are going to do with it once the waste gets there? Make glow-in-the-dark cell phones? I think not. Now, while China has graciously volunteered to take over the nuclear waste cleanup following the last shark NATO attack on North America, we These still... storms created the nuclear disaster. Dr. Abagon. Nova. I'm sorry I blew up your lab last time I was at CERN. Am I still banned? Still banned. L London is in, in, in shambles. It, it's burning, and we're Mr. here having our Ambassador, afternoon tea. Mr. Ambassador, that is enough. We are a proud federation of countries, and you shall address everyone here with respect. I apologize, Secretary General. I have brought us a war-torn veteran, Mr. Finn Shepard. You have gone where no man has gone before. Please, shed light on this dilemma. If you underestimate these storms, you'll wind up just like Aston Reynolds and Astro X, missing and bankrupt. Now, if you want to squash this threat, you're going to have to push fear out of your mind and replace it with fury. Now, back home, we're trying to make America great again. But if you follow my lead, we'll make the world great again. And then what? How do we fight this threat? Our strongest weapons are knowledge and preparation. 
Now, each time these Sharknadoes appear, they're bigger, stronger, and stranger. We need to anticipate the next evolution. They evolve like apes. Unless you can prove there's some truth to this. What the truth is, is that we found out that our ancestors were also terrorized by these Sharknadoes. But they fought back and they won. And they won with this. Oh, dear. Our ancestors wanted us to inherit this knowledge, but first we have to find out how to decode it. Nova, the stone. Mr. Prime Minister, you're alive. It's coming! Again! What did you two do? Where is it coming from? Can't tell. Bad reception, but close. That has to be the one that Gil's in. My parasol! at a speed of 500 miles per hour. My seats are too weak. I don't have enough energy to fly. Mr. Shepard, come with me. We can give you a lift. Look, Dr. Angel is waiting inside for us. A blimp? It's not just a blimp. It's the Hindenburg XP-3000. Did you say Hindenburg? I know. Bad family name. But it can withstand a tornado. Yes. Where is Dr. Wobbegon? Sharknado got him. I'm so sorry. Well, everyone's replaceable. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard. Good to see you, Dr. Angel. What can I do for you? Our son is trapped in a vortex inside a Sharknado. We have to wait for the storm to dissipate before we can get inside. Why wait? We can use the magnetic ion generator tractor to force the storm to evaporate. I've learned a lot since bartending school. I'm gonna activate the magnetic charge. Will that help? We need protection if we're gonna fly directly into a shark NATO. Get ready for a massive scientific event. The vault is empty. I swear there was something inside. Dr. Angel, just get us close to the shark NATO. Don't put us inside. Well, too late for that, Shepard. What's happening? We just hit the shark NATO. Uh-oh. We're in trouble. Dankeschön. Come on. We need to get in that Sharknado. Dissolve the Sharknado in order to expose the vortex. Let's use this stuff. Come on. We're too late. 
April, take this. Why? You gotta use it as a propeller. We have to draw Gil Sharknado closer to us so we can get into it. I'm a lot of things, Finn, but I'm not a human helicopter. You gotta try it. It's for Gil. Okay. You guys take cover. Come on. You got this, April. Come on. up. Just leaving you a message. I'm worried about you. Everything's under control. Well, actually, Steven next door is doing all the work for me. I heard that. I think he's got the hots for Grandma. I heard that, too, and it's true. What can I say, man? She's smoking hot. Claudia is with the Colonel in Houston, consulting with NASA. Send Mom and little Gil my love. I'll talk to you soon. What are you looking for, sharks? <laughs> Bad habit, I guess. You okay? Gil's in there. It's moving further away from us. <sighs> Not for long. Rush! Rush! Yeah! Yeah! Rush! Hurry up, Finn! The vortex is closing! Be still inside the Sharknado. Or he's over there. We're in Australia. How the hell do we get to Australia? Surrounded by 
shots! I forgot they come from here. Stay still. What do we do? Back together. Stay still! We're gonna toss down a road! Coast of Australia is in a state of high alert as emergency services prepare for extreme weather. Carl? Lisa Gale and strong wind warnings have been issued for the Sydney area. Winds are currently at 50 knots an hour. You're going to want to hold on to your budgie smugglers. So we advise Australian residents you'd better run. You better take cover. I'm just saying the hospital's not going to be able to fix her cyber technology, but I know who will. Australia's top weapons expert to be exact. Stop bouncing so hard, sweetie. Sorry, honey. When we get there, let me do the talking. Ursa! Ursa, code red. Who are these people? Are you a doctor? Who... No, Finn. They're better than doctors. I'm not leaving my wife alone. I'm not alone. You're always here with me. Finn, I promise. They're gonna take care of her. You're in good hands, April. The best. Miss Shepard, it is an absolute pleasure to meet you. Looks like you've had quite the adventure. I wish we were meeting under different circumstances. Your wiring's rather wonky. It's like someone tried to shove a Commodore 54 hard drive into a MacBook Pro. Who put you together in the first place? My father. Oh, typical. Oh, man. No worries, love. Oh, yeah. We'll fix you up. Since you're tuning me up, do you think that maybe you can make me less... Robotic? Leave it to me, love. I've had tons of experiences in these kind of makeovers. Yeah, Mum's got the magic touch. And nothing's gonna stand in my way. I'm gonna need the digital zoning enhancers. Got to just stay away from everything labeled Cyberdyne. Have you spoken to the other sisters? Everyone's on full alert. It's a busy day. How do you afford all this? We don't. The Sisterhood is a covert organization. Our sect includes world leaders, doctors, and even a stripper. I heard that. So you're working with governments, military? Nope. We're actually efficient. What is this thing? That's a tracking system. Shows every location of a Sharknado sister. Actually, I need to alert my China contact. Don't be mad. About what? You recruited my cousin? This is a cult. It wasn't a coincidence that Gemini was in Las Vegas while I was taking care of Paris. She's always been a sister. This doesn't look good! Why did you tell me? Because I know you, and I know you would never allow me to put your family in any kind of danger. Gemini, what's the situation like in China? My radar indicates we're 10 miles from the cyclone. Once I securely dock the tanker, I'll call you right back. Gemini, it's glitching. I need to try the other monitor. Oh, look, a couple more knots and this entire ship could capsize. Gemini, get someplace safe till I can come get you. No, Gemini, you have to contain the waste. We can't risk contamination. Copy that. What are you telling her? Oh, damn it, I lost her. 
She's my blood. You don't get to tell her what to do. She's part of the sisterhood. She's my family. Well, I need your family fighting on the field. The most important thing is saving, saving the my world. Son. Really? Is that so? We used to be on the same side, Nova. Well, there's a reason I don't play follow the leader anymore, Finn. You're always so short-sighted. If your family wasn't involved, you'd probably still be running some bar somewhere, reliving your glory days. Is that so? Well, what about you, Nova? What about you? It's never really been about the Sharknados, has it? It's been about you wanting to kill every shark in the ocean because one killed your grandfather. Does a sisterhood know they're laying their lives on the line for that? These tornadoes just an obstacle getting in the way of the revenge you've always wanted. My number one priority right now is untapping the power in that artifact. And yes, Finn, I hate sharks. I hate them more than anything, and you know that. Once they're gone, wiped, annihilated, dust, then yes, all this can go away. And then maybe, just maybe, we can go back to living peaceful lives where no one we love or care about has to die anymore. Seems like we're on the same side to me. I don't. So we couldn't repair your flight module. You can't fly anymore. But we did upgrade your cyberkinetics. Plus no more constant recharging. Yeah, and your entire body is a living solar battery. And you control it all with that switch on your arm. So what do you think? I think you're awesome. Careful. Too much energy could override your circuits and cause an internal rupture. I don't think one kiss is going to overload her circuits. Is that what you think? <laughs> no, just don't get too physical, OK? You're vibrating. She's receiving some kind of signal. Where is it coming from? Mommy! Help! Gil. It is Gil. Look. Where is he? He's headed right toward us. Starting the reconfiguration process. It's time to see if this house can do what it was built for. What the hell's going on here? This isn't just an opera house, Finn. It's a battle station. Come on! Get to it! Wait, we, we have a new development. Roger, can we get a visual on this? What you're seeing is the Sydney Opera House, or at least what we all thought was just an opera house. The opera house is breaking up. No, 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 no. It's transforming, I think. Transforming into what? Well, the shells of the station are blooming out into an offensive weapon of some kind. That is extraordinary. I can't believe it. Yeah, and I thought it was just an overrated piece of architecture. Shells two and three are stuck. Is that bad? If one goes, they all go. Tell Orion. What's gonna happen? Oh, I think we lost another shell. Oh, this is bad. Real bad. Shells two and three are still locked. They'll have to be released manually. Call in the hook. Hawk 
to Orion and Electra. I am in position. Copy that. Can you unlock the grid lines? We need to get the shells in position. It's not working. I'm gonna have to cut the lines. The skill inside that vortex. Yes, uh, think of it as the inside of a Twinkie. The Sharknado acts as a protective barrier around the teleportation vortex. How do we get inside that thing? We need to jump in, grab him, and then jump back out. A bungee cord. We bungee in off the harbor bridge, grab him, and bungee out. Yeah, yeah, uh, the shell barrier will stabilize the Sharknado. It'll make it easy for you guys to jump in. Sorry for the way I spoke to you earlier. So am I. We may not be blood, but we are family. Don't forget that. Get your boy. I'll be fighting down here. Come on. I have a message from Nova. You have five minutes before the Sharknado hits the bridge. Use the cables on the roof for your jump. Best of luck. Thanks. Move. That'll push the storm out to the ocean. Engage the Paxton Initiative. On my mark. Three, two, one. Hurry, the vortex is opening! Oh my god. She took my artifact. Throw another shock on the Bobby, eh? You ready to take the punch at Big Ed? Let's do it. Looks like Rio. You brought the artifact. I thought it'd help us find Gil. Finn Shepard! The great American hero. Ha! My girlfriend's gonna love this. Come with me if you want to find your son. How do you know about Gil? Nova sent me. She keeps tabs on your whereabouts at all times. She tagged me. Man, every time there's a Sharknado, you're right in the middle of it. What are the chances of that? A hundred percent. I'm gonna take you to Vega. What's Vega? You mean who is Vega? Get in. I have a bad feeling about this. Come on. Vega, you have visitors. Welcome. What can I do for you? You know what to do with this? Where did you get this? Stonehenge. Ours is a mathematical universe. The ancients knew this, and they devised a complex system to protect against Sharknado disasters. 
So it's like an ancient security system. Orca Julio, get ready for the kill. Each arrangement has a lock to keep the sequence of stones secure. And should one fall into the wrong hands, it will mean the end of us all. You have to return it to Stonehenge. Stonehenge is underwater. So swim. Wait, there has to be another way. What if we took the stone to Peru or, or Egypt? The world has many portals, but they are each very different. There are rules you must follow. Go back to where all this started and do it fast. As long as this stone is in your possession, you can create a Sharknado at will. I can create a Sharknado. How do we make one, Vega? If you clear all thoughts and you focus, it will manifest. Allow me to demonstrate and show you. Where's the stone? that stone. Pretty good at this. We have to follow the shark data. Over there. No, 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 no. Come on. No. 
No, no! No, no! Gil! No! Damn it! It closed! Ah! I don't know what to do anymore. I'm sorry. Can I have three coins? For what? Well, this is the Trevi Fountain. People used to come here to make wishes. You take the coins, you throw them over your back, and bam, the wishes come true. I'm willing to try anything. When in Rome. Come on. Where are we going? To get our son back. Um, Mr. Shepard. Who's asking? There's someone that needs to see you. Will you come with me? I don't have time for the Sharknado Sisterhood stuff. Come on. Finn, let's see what she has to say. It'll be worth it. What is a Sharknado sister? Is that how I think it is? Yes, it is. E lui, il grande cacciatore di squali, pensavo che fosse più alto e più robusto. Forgive me, Father, for I am Finn. Torio ripete se stessa, ma non giudicare quello che è stato dato. You should get the Pope back to the Vatican. Another storm could materialize any second. He brought you here for a reason. Look, I'm flattered, and it's an honor, but I gotta come up with a plan to find my son. Well, maybe your plan is also his plan. Well, if it has anything to do with saving my son, I'm all ears. This is the last chance to save mankind, my son. Oh. What will you do with that? I'm gonna rescue my son. And then I'm gonna save the world. I'm not throwing away my shot! Squashing all these bugs. I just want you to have a good time. Come on, it's our honeymoon. Well, we throw the ball around for a little bit and then we can go back to the hotel. <laughs> you know how much I love playing with your balls. Is it a creature? No, it doesn't appear to be a sentient being. Just, just a blob of sharks. Wait a minute. It seems to be changing its course. Oh my god. It's heading towards Japan. You see Gil's vital signs? Yes, his vital signs are strong. Okay, next Sharknado, we'll go get him. Because I learned something. It's just like surfing. It's all about the timing. When you're on a board, you have to connect with the wave's movement. That's what we're gonna have to do next time we go into a Sharknado. I'm just gonna have to find the same current gills floating in. I'll line up with them, and I'll grab them. Let's hope that logic holds up. And now you want logic? Well, it's just hard to believe that a stone could start a Sharknado. I don't want gill lost forever in a Sharknado. Remember what Vega said. Clear your mind of all thoughts. I should go into the 
Sharknado. Even if I can't fly anymore, my body's constructed for it. I know, but you're a lot stronger than I am. I'm gonna need you to pull me out once I grab Gil. Come to daddy. That's a huge shark. That's no shark. That's a sharkzilla. Steven, help with this stuff. The storm's coming. We don't have time. No, no, wait. Come here. Check this out. Somebody just tweeted this to me. Is this real or am I seeing things? Anything's possible. Let's see what I can find on the Xfinity stream app. Tell me, how has your family been affected by the Sharknado hitting North America? Oh, I had a cousin up in Niagara. I love talks, too. That's not the news. Check I out the like news. Six legs. While Sharknados continue to ravage the planet, we just learned of shocking new developments in Japan. Yes, we did. Cap, joining us live from Tokyo to tell us all about it is Chicago Today host Howard Beale. Hello, Howard. Thank you. Well, the world is on the eve of destruction, another sign of the apocalypse. I don't know what it is. It's lots of gross, disgusting masses of sharks eating everything in this city. That is messed up. What are we gonna do now? Huh, back to the real one. That's how you do it. One down, five thousand more to go. Level up! Okay, listen up, sisters. Here's the 411. We're dealing with a symbiotic organism of sharks capable of changing its shape. The plan is to drop down, then to shoot, slice, dice, and mutilate until there's nothing left. And don't get cocky. If you get too close, it will suck you in, just like it did to Gil. I got that little boy into this mess. We have to get him out. Remember, when you see a shark, grab him by the fin. Now let's go slay these bastards. What is she doing? She's saving our son. Uh, oh, no, help!
Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Oh, come on. Hold it together. Come on. You're going to be all right. Come on. It's going to be okay. You've been through a lot worse at the bar. You remember George giving you a hard time? This is nothing to bear to that. You hold it together, Nova. <laughs> Hey, 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 look at me. Focus. I'm so sorry. You're gonna be okay. You stay with me. You stay with me. Nova, Nova. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Gil's gone. He's dead. I did everything I could. I'm so sorry. Stay with us. Nova, you pull it together, Nova. You pull it together. Gil has to be alive. You can fight this, Nova. Come on, you got this. I'm not losing you, too. Nova! Breaking news from our Today Show global correspondent, Ron McDonald, who landed in Africa with a most unnerving development. Ron. The storm is soaking up lions and now get killed. Now there's sharks chasing the lions, chasing the gazelles. It's a safari NATO! As the United States prepares for what may be the worst storm in its history, it's time to go over and check in with Al for the latest on it. Hey, Al. Okay, ladies, here's the deal. As Europe is literally being torn apart by one Sharknado attack after another, the United States facing its own threats. Texas obliterated. San Francisco in ruins, as is most of California. In fact, a lot of the Midwest has been annihilated. And New York City is the only East Coast city that hasn't been attacked yet. But we have reports that a Sharknado is heading right down Tornado Alley, wiping out communities and about to rip through Kansas yet again. It is as if the first Sharknado attacks on these cities were test runs for the real deal. This looks like it could be the last curtain call, not just for America, but for the world. Hey, Ned, where's your friend Ray? We gotta get her to the storm shelter. She's in there. Ray! Ray! Oh, no! We got to get out of here. Steve, grab my hand. Clark, oh. grab my hand. Ah! No! Matt. Dad! I tried to save everyone. It didn't work. Grandma and Stephen, they're gone. They're dead. There's no safe place anymore. Matt. The Colonel, Claudia, everyone is dead. No, 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 no. Matt, Matt, you listen to me. Just do it, Matt. Be the man I know you are. Dad! I love you! Ah! Matt! They're gone. They're all gone. No. Oh. I'm not gonna let it end this way. Not after what we've been through. Not after what our family sacrificed. Not after all the people we lost. As long as me and you were together, it's not over. There's gotta be a way. Let's go to Stone Edge. Return the artifact. You have nothing left to lose. 
Let's do it. Definitely not England. We really need to learn how to navigate these Sharknados. Come on, we'll find another way. There's that symbol again. The world has many portals. Come on. Stonehenge. So the druids use the artifact as lock, right? Yeah. Maybe the Egyptians use it as a key. Hold this. It looks like it's inside the core. The Egyptians must have built a machine to control the core. We gotta find a way to start it up again. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Let's find out. Gemini, are you okay? Finn! Oh god, we thought everyone was dead. The storm stopped. It's over. It worked. We lost everyone, our entire family. Oh no. What's happening? We gotta stop this. No, April. If you absorb too much energy, you're gonna die. For good. No more second chances. There is second chances. I got you.
that Dusseldorf has been completely wiped off the map by a barrage of Sharknado and attack. Our weather radar confirms that a huge Sharknado has just entered Berlin airspace. No, no, stay with me, stay with me, stay with me! No, no, no! April, April! Is anybody out there? Is there anybody out there?
Who are you? That's my sons. What'd you do with my son? Hi, Dad. That's not possible. Semper Paratus. The shepherds always prepare. How? It's complicated. I can tell you on the way. Come on. Where? Where it all began. It's the only way to save Mom, our family, and the world. Come on, you gotta trust me, Dad. Is that really you, Gil? <laughs> <laughs> How'd you do it? How did you survive the explosion in Tokyo? Well, it sent me back in time. Then it took years, and I figured out a way to harness a vortex to bring me back to you, Dad. So you turned a Sharknado into a time machine. Yep. That's my boy. That's my man. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so what about this? You need a license to drive this thing? Where we're going, you don't need a license.